I'm sold. It sounds amazing. Thanks, guys. All right, if you're a fan of the circus, you like the high wire, the acrobats, and more, well, we have really got a treat for you. Cirque du Soleil is out in town this month, and it is visually stunning. We got a chance to go to Westport's waterfront and get a behind-the-scenes look at the show. ABC2 News' Manny Locke spent the day with some of the performers. As a kid, we all dreamed about being an entertainer and traveling the world with a circus. The Sodikova twins are living that dream. When we were small, my sister, she was um, dreamed to be a clown at circus. So all the time when we go to circus, she always uh, was in love with the clowns. And uh, this is, was actually her dream, but my dream is to come uh, later. The Cirque du Soleil show called Totem takes the audience on a tour of the evolution of man, from amphibian to first flight of man. The show takes you through different myths, symbols, and legends, and different environments of man through visual effects. The Cirque du Soleil show is about incredible acrobatics, obviously, but it's also about the costume, the music, the makeup, the whole acting on the stage, and it, you, wouldn't ex you won't expect what you're going to see. It is surprises after surprises, and it keeps you on your toes and on the edge of your seat. There are 19 touring shows throughout the country, with 52 performers and 18 different nationalities. The twins are called Crystal Ladies, who are foot jugglers. And this is their first time in America, and they love being on tour. Yeah, we love to travel. Eh? If we don't love no. to travel, we'll never be uh, a circus performer but at first. Then for the normal people, they come to understand how you can you know, change the city every month, change your house, you not miss your house, your friends, your parents. But in each new city, you meet new people, new friends. You see a lot, you learn a lot, and uh, we enjoy it. American people, it's amazing yeah. audience. <laughs> amazing. Much better. Much, much so better. Much, much better. Really. They're so they enjoy happy. It. Mm. It's, uh, it's amazing audience. Yeah, they really like they really the kids. They come to the yes. circus, they enjoy, they enjoy it. They're really happy. You can see this, you can feel this. In downtown Baltimore, I'm Manny Locke. All right, Cirque du Soleil's Totem opens tomorrow night to the public, and it runs through April 24th. There are 24 total shows, all taking place under the big top at the Westport Waterfront, which is south of the stadiums. And just a heads up, the show runs two hours and 30 minutes long. I know you've never been to a Cirque du Soleil show. Right. They are so stunning. And it's, it's the costumes, it's the acrobats that are involved in it. It's just amazing what these people can do with their body. And this one, you know, is looking at evolution, so it's right. kind of neat. Well, one of the things I have to confess is I've been to Vegas on several occasions, and every time there's a Cirque du Soleil show there. But you always seem to find something else to do in the city, and I've always thought, I'll get around to it. I'll get around to it. Well, now's the chance. Now you can see it in your new hometown. All right, off to a break. Back to wrap things up in just a bit.